The participants of a meeting focusing on preserving intangible cultural heritage have expressed their support for the project. Intangible cultural heritage covers methods and processes on how certain practices are done, such as performances, cooking, and music. And several teams have been formed to record these processes for posterity. ZIZ News spoke with participant Isis Walters Phipps, who spoke of the importance of preserving our culture and our sense of identity. We want to make sure that the generations that are coming after us get to know about their culture, the folklore, the things that the, the elders ate, our grandparents, how they did things. You know, a lot of things are coming out of America and different countries around the world and we are slowly but surely forgetting where we come from and a lot of the things that people think that are new inventions are not really new inventions. We have been using them for decades, for years. She said this effort is particularly important for the next generation. The children and the generations after us are not being taught properly what it was like. So this is what we are actually doing. We are trying to show them, trying to teach them, bring it back so that they can see and appreciate what we were then and, and, and what we are now. Wednesday's meeting between the Ministry of Culture and the ICH teams was held to determine the best way forward in recording and preserving various forms of intangible cultural heritage. The participants also expected to share their findings with the public during a seminar slated for February.